Hello you guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. This is Saturday, um, March. March the 28th, 2020. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed the, my yesterday dinner that I cooked at Chipotle burrito. Now here's the deal, okay. This is what I'm cooking in my kitchen. Again, yes, it's gonna be leftover because I had a lot of this leftover. Then the pinto bean, that's the meat, the rice, two different rice. And this is another rice that I had. I'm gonna mix it with this corn. And these is all my topping. Okay, that's the sauce. Now, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna brown some ground beef. That's what it's called. Because you know what? They have ran out of the roast, I mean the uh, ground beef that I always get. Only ground beef they had with this. And it was limit on that. They didn't have too much. But here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cook some more meat to add, you know to add with this and this is when I brown it I as I always do the onions and garlic and this right here you guys is um chipotle um adobo sauce okay let me show you how it look okay you see it's kind of whole pepper see that and I, I know you guys know what that is but I'm gonna cook it with the ground beef okay so I got my pan already uh, so instead of me making uh, the chipotle burrito this time I'm just gonna make it uh, the burrito bowl now on the side they always give you flour tortilla you know, if you want to, you know, go ahead and, you, you know, eat a fly or tortilla on side. But that's what I'm going to make because uh, I have a lot of leftover. So I'm going to go ahead and make the uh, burrito bowl. Okay, now I'm going to brown the ground beef. And now I add up my season to the ground beef. And this is the season that I use. So you can stop this video and pause it if you want to write it down. And also I use um, half a season and then a shot. So what I did was just freaking each season in the pan. So if you're a cook, you know how much to put in. Okay, I put two tablespoons of the fresh this garlic. That's what I put in. Two tablespoons. And now, when I do, I add two of the pepper, the um, the poly pepper, with the aubergine sauce. That's what I added. Now I'm just heating up my meat, the pork cornita. That's how you say. Also, you guys, I'm just going to add a little bit of chicken broth or just to, just to steam it. I 
that much. I don't want to add water. Just a little bit for the good steam. But it get real hot. That's all. Okay, you guys, I had to add another can of pinto beans. So I'm going to make the burrito bowl. Yeah. So, just add another. So what I add to this, I, I just finish, you know what, it really doesn't matter if you make it, but I just kind of mix all the rice just in one pot, so it could be easy. So that's what I did, I just mix everything together, and I add uh, a little chicken broth to it, as you can see. Yeah. So I'm going to turn this off, this is hot enough. Okay. okay, now my dinner is ready. My breakfast bowl, so I'm going to go ahead and prepare it. That's the ground beef, the other meat, the rice, the beans, the corn, and these is the topping. cheese and the lettuce okay so so watch me prepare my bowl here's my bowl that's why it's good to say these kind of bowl when you make this kind of stuff okay okay now my dinner is ready my breakfast bowl so i'm gonna go ahead and prepare it that's the ground beef the other meat the rice the beans, the corn, and these is the topping. The cheese and the lettuce. Okay, so, so watch me prepare my bowl. Here's my bowl. That's why it's good to say these kind of bowl when you make this kind of stuff. Okay. I add my lettuce at the bottom. Okay, so I'm gonna add the beef. See how I do that? Added this on top of the beef. Okay, add the rice. So what I did, I just add my cheese because the rice and stuff is very hot. So I just want the cheese melt while I'm building my burrito bowl. Also, that helped melt the cheese. I add the pinto beans. Okay, now I added my corn. Okay, I add my pico sauce with the tomato and onion. Okay, there's my burrito bowl. So the only thing you have to do, I know at the uh, Chipotle restaurant, you eat this, you know, on the side of the flour tortilla. 
so that's what you eat it with the flower tortilla on the side so it is that you guys hope you guys enjoy this video give this video a thumbs up like it share with your friends and family to see what's cooking in my kitchen also subscribe to my channel and if you already subscribed to my channel thank you so much i appreciate it and if you want to see the latest upload video on my channel don't forget to turn on your notification bell to see the latest upload video and until then i will see you in the next video again have a good night and happy saturday and be blessed